Welcome back. If you've thought about taking a river cruise, but you're a little unsure about how it all works, what the cost breakdown is, uh, and where you would want to go, all of those questions can be answered tonight at a special evening being planned at the Art Gallery. We have Kim Lucy joining us with Viking Cruises, uh, one of the very well-known uh, river cruise companies uh, around the world. It's great to have you here. Thank you. It's yes. really a treat to be here as well. Yes. Well, we're thrilled you can be here. Uh, Kim was uh, fighting the airlines trying to get here on time. We're glad you made it. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Tell us a little bit about Viking, first of all. Well, Viking is not just a river cruise company. We also have beautiful ocean ships as well. But we started 20 years ago uh, sailing on the rivers of the world. Uh, we started in Russia, and we now sail with 60 ships worldwide. We also added four beautiful ocean ships in the last th uh, two years. And we're, we literally are sailing around the world. But it, it's a fantastic experience for people who want to uh, see Europe and want to do it in a relaxing way. We do have some more exotic destinations for those kind of off the beaten track travelers, but um, it's our ships are small. There are about 150 to 200 passengers, so it's a relaxing way to be able to uh, to see some of these smaller medieval villages and some of the iconic cities of Europe, and not have to pack and unpack every single day. Exactly. We're going to check out uh, a video as we talk here. Uh, it just looks like such a beautiful way to see Sail Europe uh, from the water, ways, getting off at ports, I'm sure, and seeing it from land as well. Uh, this has really grown in popularity, Kim, in the last several years, but Viking's been around since the start of it all. Uh, what sets you guys apart? Well, one of the key things is these beautiful ships that you're seeing on, on the uh, monitor right now. Uh, they're identical. They're wide open, beautiful, beautiful windows everywhere. So you feel like you're wrapped by the destination. They're small enough to sail right into the heart of the city. So when you, when you arrive, you step off and you're right in the middle of the old center of the city. Viking owns a lot of the docking locations, so it allows us to guarantee, in many cases, that access, similar to what you're seeing right there. And we also um, own and operate, which is another big difference. Um, all, all of our staff works for Viking, and we're able to hire some of the best in the industry because we do have a lot of ships and we also operate throughout the year. Okay. Uh, so tonight uh, at the Art Gallery, you are offering a sort of an exclusive seminar to people who are interested to come and learn more, uh, what will you be going over? Well, I'll be talking about one of our most popular itineraries called the Grand European, which goes from Amsterdam to Budapest, visiting some of the, the smaller medieval cities, the castles of Europe, um, tasting wine and some of the... Uh, and getting to see some of the beautiful art and music of the area. I'm also going to touch on Russia, which is where we started. And for those that are interested in art and history and, uh, and that culture, it's another incredible destination that takes you from Moscow to St. Petersburg and through some of the, the smaller villages along the waterways of Europe as well. So people that are interested will have a chance to come and enjoy um, and learn a little bit about both of those destinations. Mm -hmm. Are the prices of these types of trips coming down at all because we're seeing more competition enter the industry? A little bit. We do run some really great promotions with um, with free air, which is a huge savings for people these days. Um, but um, remember that we do include a lot, and so you're not going to see the prices that you see on Caribbean uh, cruises or maybe a uh, cruise to Alaska. Uh, we include beer, wine, and soft drinks with meals. We include the Wi-Fi. We include a shore excursion in each port of call, all your accommodation and meals. So a lot of things are included um, already, so you don't have those surprises when you get to the end of your trip. And no one likes those surprises at the no. end of the trip. <laughs> I always feel like I've held, I've been held ransom when they give me that uh, final that final bill. Final bill, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, so this is taking place tonight at the Art Gallery, 6.30. Uh, I mentioned that the exhibits at the Art Gallery will be open. The Art Gallery store will also be open. This is mm -hmm. exclusive just to the people who come to this tonight. But if you are interested in coming down, you need to RSVP to TravelWise. And while we don't have that on the screen now, we will have it in the next segment. But I can tell you it is 851 Zero two one one again eight five one zero two one one RSVP six thirty tonight at the Art Gallery. Kim, what a pleasure to have you here today. Thank you, my treat yes. to be able to come and enjoy yeah, this as well. Fantastic. Thank you. Quick break. We'll be right back. Stay with us.